Well, as you can probably tell from my accent, I'm from Greece and I'm very proud of my heritage, right? I received a lot of love growing up and I want to give that love back to, to others. Excellent, excellent, that's the spirit. Teaching financial information analysis, uh, even the title might sound boring, but you know, I bring uh, soul to the numbers and I make it lively and relevant. What does it mean to have 125% financial leverage, Felix? Nice haircut. He just loves this stuff and it exudes it. And so he gets the class engaged, he gets the class accountable, we're listening, we're participating. Once you have their attention, then you can infuse a new idea. In my class, it's really a combination of lectures and cases. So mostly cases that I actually create, real time, real life examples that are happening on a daily basis and I bring those to the class. We're after good ideas. Our time is finite and there's more to life than FIA. We're challenged more to think about the possibilities and the drivers and the reasons for things to happen than just the equation. I try to mix up specialties. So I will mix up the engineers and the poets with somebody in finance. Every type of knowledge becomes relevant in our class. Learn from each other. The more diversity I have in my class, the better my class. Where did that, you know, 44 go or something? The correct number is... This is not just a finance class. This is a way to think about the world. I feel Berkeley in my classroom is a platform for change. I believe in democratizing access to financial education. And I'm on a mission through my teaching, through my research to mitigate, hopefully to solve the, the problem of uh, access and equality to financial education. I feel like, you know, a lot of changes can start from the classroom and then be scaled up, you know, at the level of society. Question the status. Well, right. He asked us to criticize not only those ideas that he presents, but those that we have. Every year I learn. I learn so much you know, from my students. It's sort of a new set of students, new set of experiences. So I learn from them. They force me to get better at what I do. And there's always open questions. The more I teach, the more I realize how much I don't know. And that's incredible because it keeps me motivated. When I learn and when I feel like I'm growing, I feel happy.